Ash Cross 1290 coming with you with some more Pokemon Emerald. In the last episode, we have just caught our new Pokemon Ralt. And in this episode, we are going to head back to the Pokemon Center and heal up after we battle this trainer right here. Did you just become a trainer? We're both beginners. Yes, yes, we are. Hello, trainer. Anyway, while I battle this trainer, I hope you guys love the new Pokemon Biles I did. Because I know I did. It was really fun making them. And I will let you know when I do make one. Sorry for the bit of a surprise there if you guys got surprised. But enough about Pokemon Biles. I say we get into this Pokemon battle here. Right here we have Ross, which has no attack moves at all. So what are we going to do about that? Well, a cool thing about Pokemon is that you could switch your Pokemon off in the middle of the battle. And if I kill the Lilagoon with this W Cross here, not only will W Cross get the experience, but so will Roth. The experience will be cut in half from the total, but it will be distributed between both my Pokemon, which is really cool. So let's attack the Lilagoon here. Now, it's, it's really good to be switching off your Pokemon like this, but it does leave you vulnerable. Like, I took two tackles instead of one because I switched out. But now we're going to switch out Pokemon again. And right here is the introduction to Talo. So I'm going uh, to be quiet here for one second so that the bio could come up. <laughs> Okay, that should have been enough time for the bio. Each bio is going to be 10 seconds. And it's going to have the rival battle music with a little description of its name, where to find it. Um, what else was on there? Where to find it? What type it is? Its evolutions? And what I rate it? Anyway, this is Tato here, a bird-type Pokemon, in which um, I could possibly catch it here, I believe. I don't know the details yet, but this Tato is a really good Pokemon. I love it, and in the near future, I hope this Tato will become important to me. I will not spoil what I'm going to do with the Tato, but you'll find out later in this LP. Anyway, we defeated that youngster here. Pretty simple. Got introduced to new Pokemon, so let's head back to the Pokemon Center, sh shall we? Alright, just walking back to the Pokemon Center. Nothing new, nothing new. So let's just heal up our Pokemon here. Yes, let's rest up here. And revive all our Pokemon. Yay, thank you for restoring our Pokemon to full health. I um, really appreciate it, Nurse Joy. Anyway, let's continue on here through Route 1 or 2 with our Ross taking the lead. Here is another trainer here. This is a Bug-type trainer. This guy's going to have two Worm Pools and I've already done the Vile Worm Pool, so we don't need to worry about it. So you don't, you're not about to have something pop up on your screen playing music and something you have to read because I'm too lazy to add on my own voice. And it's not that I'm lazy guys, it's that I don't have the power to, it's just, I don't know. But I'm doing the best I can here and I'm doing imagination here. But let's just have W Cross destroy these worm pull while I train up my rods in the background. And uh, W Cross made a level before our Roth did. Isn't that impressive? Yes, um, and like my um, bio said about Roth, this is a really good Pokemon, but you might have trouble training it up because it does not learn an attack move to level 6, so it's out of commission until then. 
But if you go back to that middle, if you catch a Ralt before you even start battling these trainers, I'm pretty sure it'll be level 6 before you make it to the next town. I mean, our Ralt is about to hit level 5 and we only defeated two trainers. I, I'm pretty sure uh, this early in the game, there is no way to teach Ralt a, a, an attack move. Unless you do some trading around with other people or from another game and yeah. I mean, that's a raw sprite there. Those are his stats. He grew up to level 5. Not that good. At least not as good as W Cross. But he will get up there. And we, defeat, and we defeated Rick. The bug catcher Rick. So ignoring him and moving on. And we get thrown into a battle. Is this going to be a new Pokemon? No, it's just a Pukiana. I know there are... Um, there's a few other Pokemon we could catch here, and I was probably going to make a half episode, or not a half episode, just uh, just a little episode of where I just show off the Pokemon Biles, or I might do that at the end of this episode, who knows. But I know I'm leaving this route, so I'm pretty sure at the end of the episode I'm going to include the rest of the Pokemon uh, you could catch on this route. Yes, I'm not going to do it all at one time, because that would be crazy. And I don't like doing crazy stuff. Anyway, last trainer of the route here. I am showing off these trainer battles because uh, we haven't seen enough training trainer fights yet. And I will be cutting away all these random encounters, but this early in the game, I mean, there's all kinds of new Pokemon. Uh, what do you mean, new Pokemon, Steven? Jeez. Not new Pokemon. I'm sorry, guys. As Pokemon in general. But, as we see here, we just defeated the Zigzagoon and pretty much blew it up. Oh, and we have a new Pokemon here. Isn't that dandy? A Shroomish. So, I'm going to be quiet here while the bio pops up. <laughs> Okay, and we're back. The bile should be done by now. If it was like one second in my time, but when I edit this, I'm gonna edit it really good to have a screw mission there. And I hope you guys enjoy the pictures. I mean, it's not, it's pretty easy to find those pictures, but oh well. Oh, the Shroomish might actually be the death of me. Shroomish is a grass type Pokemon, just like I said in the bio. And grass is water. Yeah, grass is water is. God, if I could talk here. Grass is water's weakness. And as you see here, it did a ton of damage to W Cross. I'm, I'm, I'm lucky it didn't do it again, or else I would have been in a real situation here. But we defeated her, and I have not gone on here to collect this potion yet. Oh my god, wake up, Steven. Wake up, S-Cross. We, we gotta do this, and we get thrown to another Pokemon battle. Who is this? Wow. Wow. Twice in the same game. Wow. This is Ross right here, guys. This is a extremely rare Pokemon. I do not know why I'm so dang lucky to find one. But I, I really recommend this with all my power. If I would make if I would recommend any Pokemon in this game, it would be a Ralts and a Mudkip. And the rest of my Pokemon team basically. Which I know what it's gonna be this time around. So no worry there. So let's just blow up this Ralts. Alright, good job, w, uh, w Cross. Yes, collect that experience like a champ. Now let's head on to the new city, a Petalburg. And because my Pokemon are in dire need of healing, I am going to be focusing my attention on healing them. Yes, heal my three Pokemon so that we can conquer the world. And yes, you will see us again. We'll be seeing this place a lot. Like, there's no lie. Get out of my way, woman. Gee, do you... Do you like getting in the way of people? Oh my god, people these days. Everywhere, just get in your way. But we are required to head into this gym here and talk to our dad. Hmm, well, it isn't as cross, so you're all finished moving in. 
I'm surprised that you managed to get here by yourself. Oh, I see. You're with your Pokemon. Hmm, then I guess you're going to be a trainer like me. That's great news. I'm looking forward to it. Um, I... I'd like to get a Pokemon, please. Hmm, oh, you're, uh... Oh, right. You're Wally, right? I'm going to stay with my relatives in Viewer Town. I thought it would be lonely by myself, so I want to take a Pokemon along, but I never caught a Pokemon before. I don't know how. Hmm, I see. That's cross. You heard that, right? Go with Wally and make sure that he safely catches a Pokemon. Wally, here, I'll loan you my Pokemon. And our dad is generous enough is generous enough to give his Pokemon to a stranger. But apparently we have to ask the professor of the game to give us his Pokemon. Because our father is too cheap to let us use his. Oh wow, a Pokemon. I'll give you these Pokeball a Pokeball too. Wow, our dad is so is so nice to strangers and not to his own child. Oh wow, thank you. Escross, will you really come with me? Yes, I will go with you. So let's just let's just walk around the corner with this goofy music and just walk straight into the grass while that girl is just staring at the fence. Oh now she turned to uh into the tree and now she's back to the fence, back to the tree. That's for us. Pokemon hiding in the tall grass like this, don't they? Please watch me and see if I can catch one and whoa encounter and you'll never believe what he encounters. A Ralt, that's level five. Every time you do this Pokemon tutorial, he always and I mean oh always encounters a Ralt. And I'm not doing nothing here. The the game is showing you how to do this, showing you how to catch a Pokemon here. But basically, if I haven't explained it better before, basically you want to lower the Pokemon health as far down as you can and then use the Pokeball. No, you do not have to call back your Pokemon like he did. That is actually pretty dangerous. But not with a Ralt since all it knows is Growl. So we're just going to have watch him throw a Pokeball and magically catch a Pokemon. One, two, three bites. So guys, how many licks does it get to catch a center of Pokemon? Apparently three. I did it, it's my my Pokemon. As for us, thank you. Let's go back to the gym. Yes, let's go back to the gym. So did it work out? Thank you, yes it did. Here's your Pokemon bag. As cross, thank you for coming along with me. You two are why I was able to catch my Pokemon. I promise I'll take really good care of it. Oh, my mom's waiting for me, so I have to go. Bye, Escross. Bye, Wally. Now, this is not the last time we'll be seeing him. We're actually going to be seeing him a lot, and we are going to be battling him later. Oh my god, spoilers. Escross, if you want to become a strong trainer, here's my advice. Head for Rustrio City, beyond this town. There you should challenge the gym leader, Roxanne. After her, go on to the other Pokemon gym and defeat their leaders. Collect badges from them, understood? Of course, I'm a gym leader too. We'll battle one day, as cross. But that's only if you become stronger. Yes, that's only if we become stronger. And stronger the better, right? Anyway, as we try to exit town here, we are stopped by this fool right here. Let me guess, from the way you're dressed, you're a Pokemon trainer. Hmm, well, maybe not. Your clothes aren't all dirty at all. You're either a rookie trainer or maybe just an ordinary kid. Just, I'm roaming these lands in search for talented trainers. I'm sorry to have taken your time. And he just walks away. Now, Pokemon Emerald is the third version of, or the combined version of Sapphire and Ruby. And Sapphire and Ruby, you will not see that guy ever. So, this add on content of him talking to us, if you're following this from Pokemon Emerald or Sapphire, I'm not Emerald. Sapphire Ruby, you will not be able to see him. Now, I do not know why I am healing my Pokemon. I was supposed to go to the Pokemart and show off what we could do at the Pokemart. So, let's head over to the Pokemart, shall we? Oh my god, I'm feeling a little sick here. I don't know if I'm going to be losing my voice. If I do lose my voice, I am extremely sorry. I won't be making videos for a few days. But here is the Pokemart. As you see here to the left where it says money, this is our money right here, and this is the stuff we could buy. Um, I, I'm going to buy two Pokeballs just in case, because there is a few more Pokemon we're going to be catching. Potions, we're going to stock up the five potions, up to five, not buy five. 
we're going to buy up to five antidotes because this upcoming area we're going to will require us to use antidotes. I'm not going to buy any repels yet because there's some Pokemon I want to catch that I'm going to use on my team. But yeah, pretty much it. Now, before we do anything else, I'm going to cut it right here and look through my Pokedex because I want to catch a Pokemon. Everyone, I'm not going to cut it. I am just going to show off what my next Pokemon will be, which is going to be a Talo. Now, you guys might have already saw the bio for it, but I haven't seen the bio yet because I haven't made it yet. When this video goes up, of course I'll made it, make it, and I'll know where exactly where Talo is. But, yeah, my third Pokemon is going to be a Talo, and it's this patch of grass right here is where it is com commonly find, find, found. So I'm going to cut it right here until I run into a Talo. Alright, so I'll see you guys then. Or I'll see you guys in a little bit. For you it's going to be one second, for me it's probably going to be half an hour. Let's look at that time down here, 10.15pm. Alright, 10.15pm. When I come back, I want you all to look at this time. And I'll tell you all the time to see how long it took me to find a Talo. <coughs> Talos are pretty rare, to be honest, and I'm going to talk through this battle because my Ross is going to hit the next level when I do. Alright, so let's just let's just hurry up and kill this Puchiana. And this Puchiana is dead. Alright, will Ross make a level? Yay! P-Cross is level 6. And he finally learned his first attack move. So from this point on, I'm going to cut it until I find my next Pokemon. So I'll see y'all then. No, I will not cut it at all, because my luckiness, I find a Talo on my second try. Wow. This is, wow. I am startled. I'm like, oh my god, I can't even talk right now. Jeez, let's see if we can catch it. I, I really want a Talo on my team. Yes, Talo's going to be our third Pokemon. Let's see, one. Damn it. I mean... Curses! Um, I don't want to use confusion again because the last attack took too much damage. So I'm going to switch over to W Cross and weaken it with him. Oh my god, I can't believe I found a tail on my second try. The Pokemon I'm going for are usually super rare. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, do I want to risk it? Apparently not. So yeah, I am going to cut it right here until I find a Talo and W Cross. Learn Water Gun. So I'll see you guys in a second with my second attempt. Wow, I didn't even have to. Wow. Third Pokemon, level 5, another Talo. My god, this this is a good sign. This is a good sign that my LP is going to be going really great. So that's just confusion. And again with half the health. Jesus. Why? Why, as cross Why are you so freaking strong? Yes! We caught our third Pokemon, everybody. With our third Pokemon, our flying type Pokemon, to be exact. Yes, we're gonna name you F Cross, our third edition of the game of the of our team. Talos are really good, and I'm gonna be talking about them throughout the game since I'm using one. So, guys, this is the end of this episode. So, in the next episode, I will show y'all. Well, I won't show y'all nothing. I'll continue on with the game and then go beat them up. Go, we'll go, we'll go see what we have to do next. All right. So in the next episode, we are gonna go to our next area and try to go to the next city. So I'll see y'all then. Bye bye. Oh, and one more thing: the Pokemon battles of the last two routes should be popping up right now. See y'all then. <laughs>